we'll be revealing the name of our upcoming 1.20 Minecraft update as soon as we figure out exactly how to pronounce it. We'll take a deep dive into that new update and all the features that have been released in Snapshots, Preview, and Betas last month. Sniffers and Cherry Blossom Biomes have made their debut in Snapshot, and we've finally started unearthing details about archaeology. The sands of Minecraft are hiding some major secrets, like my hat. <laughs> Dig beneath the overworld's sandy surface to find buried ruins mysterious structures that contain suspicious sand blocks. You'll be able to use the new brush tool to carefully extract pottery shards from the fragile sand blocks. Each shard has an image painted on it, and when you piece together four of them, you not only repair the pot, but also reveal unique stories. Like this example a Minecraft player made just for me. It's not just archaeology that's been released. This magnificent mole-like mob is the Sniffer, and it's now in the new Snapshot, Preview, and Beta. This mob used to be extinct, but can be rediscovered by looking for eggs in another new Minecraft feature, Suspicious Sand. Unearth these eggs and they'll hatch into a Snifflet, which is the cutest name I've ever heard. The Snifflet will grow up to become a Sniffer who can then sniff up unique seeds that grow into majestic plants. Right now, you'll be able to find the Sniffer in creative mode without all its functions. For example, finding and hatching the egg. But don't worry, the Sniffer that will join Minecraft 1.20 is going to have all the functionality that you voted for during Minecraft Live 2022. Players are already speculating that the Sniffer might be the happiest mob in Minecraft, mainly because its nose looks a little like a smiley face. Let's compare it to some of Minecraft's other cheerful mobs. The new Cherry Blossom biome was also released and can now be explored in Snapshot. It's a rare biome that includes the Cherry Tree Wood Set, Cherry Tree Sapling, and Pink Flower Carpet Block. But what inspired such a colorful, pleasant biome? Was it the park near our Swedish office? Can we cut to an image that'll like lift my spirits? Hmm, try something else? Ah yes, that's the ticket. So these are the new features we're introducing for the soon to be named 1.20 update. But we'll be fine tuning and deepening these features and we can't wait for your feedback. Stay tuned while we take one more look at that beautiful cherry blossom. But wait, let's not forget about armor trims. They've been out on Java snapshots for a while, but are soon coming to Bedrock Beta and Preview as well. Want to defend yourself and look stylish doing it? Who doesn't? Hunt down the templates, then use the smithing table to craft and trim your own unique armor. Going on a quest to find these elusive trims is a great way to begin a new Minecraft adventure. Minecraft Monthly accepts no legal responsibility for players who get blown up by creepers on that adventure. Coming up, we will reveal the name of the new Minecraft update. So, it's called the Trails and Tales update. <laughs> this update is all about self-expression, storytelling, and world building. And it's the journey your trails that ties it all together. In Minecraft, the stories belong to the players. And in this update, we hope to inspire more player tales by adding exciting hints of a forgotten past and by making it easier and more fun to both create and store player stories.